Thank you, David. Now on Bounce, it is time for our weekly segment with the Bounce High School Coach of the Week. We selected Coach Bobby Carroll of York Comprehensive High School. Welcome to the show, Coach. Thank you so much. Appreciate you being here tonight. We were just talking about this uh, while the other story was running. I'm, I'm not D-man, so cut me some slack, I okay? Gotcha. All right. Uh, so I want to give the viewers a little background on your team. You beat South Point 48-7. to last Friday. Now, incidentally, that's the team uh, you used to coach for. The York Cougars off to a 3-0 and start to the season, one of the top teams in the state. So tell me a little bit about your talented players and coaching staff. Well, uh, you know, we arrived in York back in uh, January of 2011. We left South Point and came to York to coach my son, and that's where I played high school football, and we changed some coaches around and uh, just got some excellent kids, some mm -hmm. hard workers. You know, that's a you know, a little rural community out there. We got about 1,500 students and have just great academic support or, from our administration, our teachers, our principal, uh, our athletic director. And it's just a great place to coach hardworking kids. Uh, that's always great to hear. This is some video of you guys doing what you do there uh, at the game. Uh, how are you preparing the team for the game at Chester this Friday? Well, you know, you can't let last week's win over South Point deter you from beating Chester, but. Uh, the players, you know, th these kids are just some fantastic kids, and that's our greatest resource our players, and um, they, they just work extremely hard at practice. And I know that's a coaching cliche, but they're taking it like a barbershop one at a time. <laughs> I was about to say, because I feel like you're, you know, you're only, you can't rest on the laurels of your last win. You always got to be looking forward to the next game, the next opponent. That's exactly right. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we, we chose some hard teams to play at the beginning of the non-region se uh, season, the conference is coming up, and we hope those games will get us prepared for, you know, down the road. Uh, let me ask you this, or let me just weigh in on, have you weigh in on this. You actually coached Jadavion Clowney, who, of course, now with the Houston Texans, number one draft pick. What's it like seeing him at that level now? Well, you know, Clowney's a, a special guy. He really is, and we've had some other NFL. Devontae Holloman played for the Cowboys and just retired because of a neck injury, and Stephon was on that team. He plays for the Buffalo Bills, Stephon mm -hmm. Gilmore, and, uh, you know, Clowney's a, he's a character, man. You really need to get to know him. And uh, I know there's a lot of things been said about him, but uh, none of it's really true, except he's a great player and he's a great person. And Delano also told me that you also credited with sort of keeping him on the straight and narrow and not letting any negative outside influence potentially derail him from, you know, where he's ultimately gotten to be. Well, it was an entourage of us that kept him going, and it, it wasn't hard. He had he has a good mom and good family and good guidance, and uh, you know his his opportunity to gain that kind of wealth wasn't going to come but one time. You mm -hmm. know, if we lose our job, we might can get another one. But <laughs> where can you go out and make hundreds of millions of dollars playing football? And uh, all that you know, the negative stuff motivated Clowney, and he went on to accept it, and uh, he plays hard and. He unfortunately had a knee injury the other night, and it, I think it's just cartilage, and he's going to be okay. All right. Coach Carroll, we appreciate your time tonight. Thank you so Best much. Best of luck this Friday against Chester. I hope when you guys bring home another win. Thank you. I hope we do also. All right. Thank you, sir. Yes, I want to get back to our sound-off topic.